Nanotechnologies is actually quite a broad uh, thing. I mean, it's not a thing. You can have different things. Nano means small. So uh, it means uh, encapsulating, for example, drugs is, is a nanotechnology. So one of the things that I will discuss is that actually putting drugs into small uh, fatty bubbles called liposomes uh, actually enables these drugs to get better, uh, to, to cross the blood-brain barrier much better. So that's one of the nanotechnologies that I will discuss. Uh, but another nanotechnology uh, is, for example, high-intensity focal ultrasound. And that's a technique in which you use micro-bubbles. And micro-bubbles are not the liposomes, but they're bigger. They're gas-filled bubbles, which you uh, inject in the bloodstream of, of a patient. And because they have small um, iron particles inside the micro-bubble, you can direct the micro-bubbles to any place in the body they, where you want them to be. And if you direct them to the, uh, for example, take the example of diffuse intrinsic pontine leoma, if you direct them to the brainstem, and you get from outside the body you give a, a um, sort of a, a ultrasound, you can shake these bubbles inside, um, inside the vessels where they are. And, it's, and, and that gives a small, uh, as we sometimes say, massage, massage of the blood vessels, which open up a little bit. And that has already been proven in, in animals, that that works that way. And when the blood vessels open a little bit, uh, and when you give uh, chemotherapy at that moment, it might cause chemotherapy to enter the, the tumor much better. So that's a technique that we are uh, currently exploring in the Netherlands, um, together with some technical universities. Now it's still very preclinical. Um, as, uh, as I know, there's one patient, one adult patient now in the United States being treated uh, this way. Um, but it's still in very early stages and I think there's a trial open now in Paris also for adult patients. One of my colleagues uh, uh, is here too and he will tell you more about this. Well the promise is uh, we've been discussing convection enhanced delivery which might uh, give chemotherapy to large regions of the tumor but there are still certain regions that you cannot reach with, uh, with convection enhanced delivery. So maybe you can use this focal ultrasound method to reach the regions that are impossible to reach with convection enhanced delivery. And also convection enhanced delivery is not, not every drug is suitable for convection enhanced delivery. So you might use the drugs that are not suitable for convection with the fre high frequency ultrasound method. And thereby with multiple ways of treating these tumors, can, uh, we might get rid of whole tumor, I hope. Well, I think it's the same take-home message as with convection enhanced delivery. New techniques are the future of treatment of brain tumors in children, I guess.